Hi everyone, if you follow me on Twitter then you are aware that this past week was National Chemistry Week and also I conducted a poll asking people what is their favorite element and why. I received 173 vo votes with 64 unique elements listed and 7 imaginary ones including the element of surprise and unobtainium. People's reasons for voting for certain elements ranged from liking how the word sounds to its significance in research and maybe they wrote their thesis on that particular paper, um, maybe it reminded them of a project they did in school, or maybe they liked the visual appeal or the cool texture of that particular element. So what I'm going to do here is to list the top eight vote getters on my poll this week and since my doll can't walk back and forth in front of the periodic table and point out the various elements like Vanna Whitewood, we're going to rely on Theo Gray's book called The Elements to show our top eight. So coming in at number eight is element 26, iron. Coming in at number seven is element 15, phosphorus. Coming in at number six is one made popular by Oliver Sacks. Element 74, tungsten. Coming in at number five, found in bananas is element 19, potassium. <laughs> At number four, it was a surprise to me, it was element 18, the only noble gas to show in the top eight, argon. In number three, is a very cool metal that's liquid at room temperature all the time. Element 80, Mercury. Our first runner-up, unfortunately, cannot take the place of our winner. That's not how it works for elements. Is element number one, hydrogen. Fuel for the stars important in organic materials. And our winner is element six. Carbon, the stuff of life and favored by biologists everywhere. Thank everybody so much for voting and participating in this poll and for your enthusiasm for science in general. Thanks. Bye.